things that we did at this site, which is a bit unique and really uh, an important uh, thing in terms of scientific knowledge, was we started monitoring um, this site from when it was bare soil through this year. We monitored again this spring. So we were able to take a site and understand it from bare soil, just been reclaimed, and how ecosystem function was restored and how the plant establishment was increasing over time. We went from like four grass species to uh, this year we've got 70 different vegetation species on site. We've got, we studied insects and, and, and uh, soil microbiology. We saw the ecosystem and the soil ecosystem develop as well. So I think we've got about 26 different bird species on site and five mammals. And one of them is on the Mongolian red list, which is a marmot, which is uh, our equivalent of a threatened and endangered list. So all excellent um, examples of sustainable ecosystem function over time. The site was producing so well, um, the herders asked if, if we might not try to grow, uh, cut some hay off the site. We did a preliminary cut and it looked pretty good. Uh, the local herders used that uh, for their livestock during the winter. Last fall, we cut over 40 tons of hay off the site uh, and provided that to the herders. And they said it was in high demand for, for cattle especially and really, really helped uh, these people get through the winter. We've become a pretty important member of the community out there over the life of this project and they come to us for quite a bit of uh, assistance. It's got scientific value, it's got utility for the local community, it's got the water well um, and it's an area that they can study and understand how best practices can be done in reclamation, not only there, but in the rest of the country. If you follow these types of best practices, your outcomes should be similar. And the university has had a number of grad students that work out on that site, collecting data and uh, going to the site and, and studying it. So we're trying to encourage, well, maybe some next generation of reclamation specialists from Mongolia might get their training from from the Aryan experience, it's there. It's it's for them as a as a, a legacy. Mm -hmm.